there is an indefinable, mysterious power that pervades everything. I feel it, though I do not see it. It is this unseen power which makes itself felt and yet defies all proof, because it is so unlike all that I perceive through my senses. Vincent Paloti heartily welcome you to celebrate this momentous day along with us. On 2nd October every year, India celebrates a national holiday in remembrance and honour of the birth of Mohandas Karamshan Gandhi as Gandhi Jayanti. This day is also celebrated as the International Day of Non-Violence by the United Nations. This year will mark Gandhiji's 151st birth anniversary. A prayer energizes the heart of a believer through the power of the Spirit. So let us start our program with a divine prayer by Sraya Joju from class 10A. Bind us together, Lord, bind us together with cords that cannot be broken. Bind us together, Lord, bind us together. Bind us together with love. There is only one God. There is only one King. There is only one body. That is why I sing. Bind us together, Lord, bind us together with cords that cannot be broken. Bind us together, Lord, bind us together, bind us together with love. Here is a little angel from the KG section with Dip Vivek with an eloquent speech on Gandhi Jayanti. I love India, I believe non-violence, truth and peace. People call me Babuji. I am a writer, lawyer, politician and Indian independence and activist. I offer love, I offer friendship, I offer peace. My life is my message. Bharat Bhada Ki Jai Jai Hind. Display and encourages children to express their point of view of the world around them. Here are some tiny thoughts from the KG to show us their innovative ideas on Gandhi Jayanti. पतित पावन सबको संमति दे भगवान 
पावन George, our manager, the teachers, parents and my dear students. On October 2nd, the world remembers a great man, Mahatma Gandhi, the father of our nation. He is called Mahatma, great soul, because he was deeply human and highly spiritual, closer to God and closer to man. He is not only just a freedom fighter, he continues to live in the hearts of people all over the world from generation to generation because his ideologies and way of life give solutions to our human problems, the problems of the world. Gandhi's approach brings changes in the heart of the individuals and thus in turn brings changes in the society and in the world. Today as the world experiences 
disunity, lack of peace, violence, religious intolerance, hatred and environmental hazards, we need to recall the Gandhian mark, the Gandhian way as a solution. As we remember Mahatma Gandhi on his birth anniversary, let us hold on to the values he stood for and the way of life he has shown to us. Happy Gandhi Jayanti to all of you. Thank you. So long as you do not take the broom and bucket in your hands, you cannot make your towns and cities clean. Mahatma Gandhi notably said and his words are true even today. Teachers and students' roles are very important to create awareness on cleanliness. Our school students have done a wonderful task to make these famous quotes realistic. Cleanliness is next to godliness. Here are some photographs of cleanliness done by our students. Mahatma Gandhi who devoted his life restlessly by spreading awareness about the importance of equality and peace of harmony in brotherhood. Here is Raya from grade 5th B with a powerful speech on Mahatma Gandhi. Good morning to all, respected manager, principal, teachers and my dear friends. I wish you all a very happy Gandhi Jayanti. Gandhi Jayanti is celebrated on 2nd October every year. This is the birthday of Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi was born on 2nd October 1869 in Port Bandar, Gujarat. His full name was Mohandas Karamchand Gandhi. Gandhiji was a great and powerful leader of India. Gandhiji spent a major part of his life to get freedom for our country. He was also known as Babu, the father of our nation. 
Gandhiji believed in simple living and high thinking. Gandhi Jayanti is also known as International Day of Nonviolence. Gandhiji's life is an inspiration for all of us. On this day, everyone should bless that we will always follow Gandhiji's path of truth and nonviolence. Thank you. A song is a short piece of music, usually with words. But let's listen to an innovative type of music without any words. It's done only by a whistle. I call upon Savrapya to astound us with her unique talent. Ima 
The power of Gandhi's words still inspire us to change the world by changing ourselves. Now let us look at some of the famous quotes and wordings by Mahatma Gandhi. The students of St. Vincent have made a gallery of inspiring quotes of Mahatma Gandhi. Peace is the most powerful weapon of mankind. Words of Mahatma Gandhi. Happy Gandhi Jayanti. The future depends on what you do today. Words of Mahatma Gandhi Ji. I offer you peace. I offer you love. I offer you friendship. I see your beauty. I hear your name. I feel your feelings. My wisdom flows from the highest source. I salute that source in you. Let's work together for unity and love by Mahatma Gandhi. Live as if you were to die tomorrow. Learn as if you were to live forever. A quote by Mahatma Gandhi. Mahatma Gandhi was a man who gave his whole life to the nation. He deserves respect not only in India but all over the world. Next, I invite Adisraya for yet another stimulating speech about Mahatma Gandhi. Good morning to all. Today, I am here before you to speak some few words about Mahatma Gandhi ji. Mohandas Karamchand Gandhi was born on October 2nd, 1869, Porbandar in India. And he is one of the most respected spiritual and political leader of the Indian nation. And is honored by the Indian people as the father of our Indian nation. His birthday is celebrated as Gandhi Jayanti and on that day it's a public holiday for all over the India. And schools and colleges will be celebrating this day and the best schools and colleges will be awarded. Mahatma Gandhi played a vital role in attaining freedom from the British. Rakupati Rakava Raja Ram, a favorite bhajan of Mahatma Gandhi ji, is sung on that day. At the age of 13, Gandhi ji married to Kasturba and have four children. Gandhiji studied law in London and returned back to India in 1891. And in 1893, he signed a legal contract with South Africa to do a legal work in South Africa. He travelled various parts of the country to motivate the people. And he even established an ashram in Gujarat, common for all the religion and caste. The three places forms a vital role in celebrating Gandhi Jayanti is the Matias Column, the place where Mahatma Gandhi was attacked in 30th January 1948 and Rajgat where the place uh, Mahatma Gandhi scaled it in 31st January 1948. The Triveni Sangam where the Ganga, Yamuna and Saraswati joins together. On 1915, he returned back to India and within 15 years, he became the leader of the Indian Nationalist Movement. On 13 January 1948, at the age of 78, he began a fast on the purpose of stopping the bloodshed. After five days, the opposing leader pledged to stop the fighting and he broke his fast. On 12 days later, a Hindu fanatic, Naduram Gods, opposing his program, assassinated him. Thank you. Mime is a form of entertainment in which performers tell a story without words by using body movements and facial expression. Our students from class 11th are all said to present a mime about honesty, an incident from Gandhi's life. Enjoy!
paper pen making competition was conducted as a part of Gandhi Jayanti celebration. Let's have a gaze at our students' creativity. can be successful without the people who dedicate the time and resource to make sure everything is spotless. Like any other speech, a vote of thanks is also dynamic. It is helpful to publicly let everyone know the roles and responsibilities of all those who worked effortlessly behind the curtain to make this an accomplished event. I invite Anna Jojo from class 12th for the vote of thanks. Greetings to all. I am very much honoured to express the word of thanks. Let me thank our principal, Reverend Father Paul Anibutil, for arranging this occasion to celebrate Gandhi Jayanti amidst the present crisis. I thank our manager, Reverend Father George Mediakal, for his valuable words which enlightened us all. I extend a heartfelt thanks to all the teaching and non-teaching staff who took efforts to create the celebration. Let me thank all the students and their parents for their support, cooperation and performances. Once again, let me thank all of you on behalf of all for creating such a wonderful and memorable Gandhi Jayanti celebration. Today, our head shall be raised, being proud to have a person who shook the world gently as the father of our nation. Wishing all a bright and safe future ahead. Thank you. All is well that ends well. On behalf of St. Vincent, I appreciate all those who presented a panorama of events and made this day a memorable one. Before we end today's program, let us take a minute to pray for the person who made the free India we see today possible. May our beloved Bapuji's soul rest in peace. Thank you and I wish you all a very happy Gandhi Jayanti.